I am holding a fossil of a sea turtle. This fossil has been in the collection here at the Academy for more than 160 years. It was during that period of time that a scientist gave this particular kind of fossil a name, Atlantichelys mortoni. However, as intriguing as this fossil is, this was all they knew. In the fall of 2012, an amateur fossil hunter in the creeks of New Jersey found this bone and the paleontologists there immediately recognized it as the distal end of a giant sea turtle. So the guys from the New Jersey State Museum came over with their half of the bone and thought, well, let's compare it and see what happens. Sure enough, we have two halves of the same bone, the same individual of this giant sea turtle, one half that was collected at least 162 years before the other half. So once we have the entire length of the humerus, we can actually calculate how big the turtle really was pretty accurately. And based on the size of this bone when it's put together, we know that this turtle was about 10 feet from tip to tail, making it easily one of the largest sea turtles that ever lived. And we would have never known that if we hadn't been able to unite these two pieces.